everyone, I've been having some hormonal breakouts lately, so I thought I'd come on here and show you what I'm doing to help clear them out, uh, detoxify my skin, and purge those little breakouts that I've been having. So right now, well first I cleanse my skin with the Salex Exfoliating Cleanser. Right now I have the Oxygen Deep Pore Cleanser on and I'm letting this sit for about 10 minutes. And then I'm going to do a special cocktail with the Super Protein Facelift Mask. Okay, so I've rinsed off the Deep, deep Pore Oxygen Cleanser. Now before I apply the mask, I am going to spot treat with the skin gel. So I'm going to put it on my cheeks and along my, along my jawline um, just to open up some of those pathways so that mask can really penetrate down and really purge out those impactions. Now, if you do not have skin gel, or if you're out of stock on your skin gel, you can actually make your own. You can mix some AJ Accelerator with a couple of drops of the astringent number two. Uh, mix those together and then apply it. That way you're getting a lot of the same benefits of the skin gel if you do not have that in stock right now. For my mask, I will be using one teaspoon of the Super Protein Facelift Mask three-fourths of a teaspoon of the Intense Antioxidant Professional Exfoliator, a fourth of a teaspoon of the Derma Pigment Skin Brightener, and a large pea-sized amount of the Skin Gel with Tea Tree Oil. If you were performing this on a client that had more inflamed acne lesions, you can actually add in some Oxygen Booster, and then instead of adding in Skin Gel, you can put in some Medication Number 5 or Medication Number 10. But this is the consistency that I have. So you can tell that it's a watery paste, a liquid paste. And so I'm just going to go in and start applying this mask everywhere. Okay, so the mask is now on. It is a pretty thick layer. This is, oh, and I got some on my shirt. This is enough that you would be able to bring this on the decollete and up the neck, but I really just put a thick layer, really rubbed it into my jawline where I'm experiencing the hormonal breakouts. Now, the reason why I added in the Derma Pigment Skin Brightener is because I have been getting some PIH, some post-inflammatory pigmentation lately. So you can either add in the Derma Pigment Skin Brightener if your client is experiencing PIH, or the Living Cell Clarify Clarifier. That will really drive those tyrosinase inhibitors down into the skin and help lighten and brighten the skin. But I'm now gonna let this sit for 20 minutes and I'll show you what it looks like before I wash. Okay, so the mask has now been sitting 20 minutes and you can tell because it's kind of hard to talk right now because it hardens so much. I'm gonna show you an easy way to remove it. Because of the albumin and the acacia, it does harden and cause a film on the skin. So something you can do is get a bowl of water and mix in some gentle face wash. Then take that fan brush that you have. I'm gonna try not to spill this all over me. And just really go in and break up that mask using the cleanser and that fan brush. suggestion that I do have is when you are working with the super protein facelift mask make sure you put an extra towel in your warm towel caddy and um, you may need it to remove the uh, extra mask that is left behind because it does harden and pull okay so the mask is all washed off and you can just see how tight and firm my skin looks it just purges everything out pulls all the toxins out of your skin. Um, I notice a huge difference in my T-zone with my blackheads um, with oil production as well. And it's not a one size fits all. You can completely customize this mask to your client's needs and what their skin condition is. For my finishing products, I will apply the AHA Accelerator first to make those pathways that the other products can penetrate deeper in from. Then I'll apply the Living Cell Clarifier Cocktail with the Vitamin C Serum. I'll use the CBD Regenerative Eye Cream. Then I will cocktail the Daily Repair Mega Moisture Cream with some Ultra Hydro Gel. And then finish it off with the Master Aesthetics Elite Photo Age Sunscreen SPF 30. The 
clients, gave you some ideas on ways that you can cocktail the super protein facelift mask for your acneic clients. And let us know if you have found any cocktails that you personally love to use on your clients.